What's up guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video I'm going to show you how you can make 76.5 million every 30 hours doing the frozen money glitch. This is the best glitch that's out on GTA Online at the moment and can make you millions in a very short period of time. So without further ado, let's get straight into the video. I am going to be posting consistent glitch videos and tips and updates, so if you guys aren't already subscribed, please consider subscribing as this is a new channel and it will help me out a lot. Right guys, so let's get into the glitch. What you want to do is open your pause menu, make your way over to online, go to swap character. Right guys, once you've loaded into a online session, what you want to do is just check your map to see if you have an owned apartment. As you can see here, I do have one. So I think if you're above level 10, I believe, as you can see, I'm level 14 then you will get given an apartment for free. Right, once you guys have made it to your apartment, what you want to do is open your phone, go to whatever website it is that you're using to buy the vehicle. So I'm just going to get some Deluxos. Buy as many as you need. Make sure though that on the last vehicle you buy, that you stay on the sold screen. I'm just going to buy three, use an example. Actually, I'll buy four. Four. Right, now I'm going to stay on the sole screen. What you do from here is you go to your home screen or whatever console it is you're using. Go to internet, turn off your Wi-Fi and then turn it back on. Once you do that, make your way back over to GTA and then it will send you to offline. And then I'll show you guys what to do from there. And as you guys can see, it gave me a notice. So now all it's going to do is load me back into GTA offline. Once you load in, make sure you give it around five seconds for it to load, as if you don't give it time to load, the vehicles on the online won't, won't basically come into the game. I'm just going to run around for a few seconds. All right, now you want to open your pause menu, make your way over to online, then GTA Online, and make sure you go into an invite-only session. If you feel like you're going to lose your money, don't worry, you won't. Even after that point, if it doesn't work, you still have your money in your bank. So you can just retry it if you did do any steps wrong. And as you guys can see, the Deluxos are in the garage and I have kept my money. You can do this with any vehicle, like I said before. Once you have sold the 27 cars in the 30 hour period, what you want to do from there is go over to online, go to swap character. And from here, all you want to do is delete the second character. But make sure that before you go onto this swap character scene, make sure that the money you've got from the vehicles you've sold is in your bank, as if it's not in your bank, the money will not transfer back over to your main character. So what I want to do from here is press square, because I'm on PlayStation, or whatever your delete button is, and then you want to press confirm. It'll come up with a text thing. What you want to do is type delete, and then press enter. It'll come up with this notice. And as you can see, my second character is now deleted. From this point, guys, the glitch is pretty much complete. If you guys haven't already, please consider subscribing. Um, I do post regular GTA 5 updates, glitches and tips. If you did like this video, please leave it a like. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.